A Seminole County woman is facing several charges after not getting her way at a Burger King in Sanford. Yeah, police say she tried to carjack an 80-year-old woman in the parking lot yesterday morning, but the victim managed to fight her off. That victim spoke exclusively this afternoon with Channel 9's Jeff Love Coolidge. And Jeff, she told you she goes to that Burger King all the time. Martha, she's a known as a regular to this Burger King here in Sanford. The 80-year-old victim told me the suspect demanded her car keys, then tried to grab them out of her hands. But she told me she wasn't going to give those car keys to her without a fight. Michelle Shockley didn't say anything as she faced the judge this afternoon. Sanford police say Shockley attempted to carjack an 80-year-old woman at the Burger King off of 1792 yesterday morning. That victim, who did not want to be identified, told me this afternoon that she had just got out of her car and was heading inside to get a breakfast sandwich when Shockley approached her. I noticed this lady walking up toward me pretty fast. I thought it was just a panhandler. And she just kept coming right up to me and said, give me your keys or I'll shoot you. But the victim didn't see a gun or anything in her hands. She says Shockley grabbed for her keys. She kept grabbing me and kept getting my, trying to get my keys and I refused to give her my keys. And so finally she tripped me, knocked me over. Someone inside the Burger King saw the commotion in the parking lot and went outside to help. That's when Shockley got up and took off across the street to the 7-Eleven. The manager of the Burger King who saw what was going on followed Shockley. She's the one who the, deserves the Medal of Honor here, believe me. She told me later that she had run across the street after that lady and tackled her and held her there till the police got there. And at 80 years old, the victim, who considers herself in pretty good shape, still says despite falling during the tussle, she doesn't have a scratch on her. Meanwhile, the suspect, Michelle Shockley, she remains in jail on $28,000 bond, and she is not allowed to return not only to this Burger King, but to the entire plaza. Reporting live in Sanford, Jeff Left Coolidge, Channel 9 Eyewitness News.